you are facing low fps lag and stutters in fortnite so guys don't worry about anything because in this video i'm gonna show you the real pc optimization you need on your pc in order to get the same exact results before and after doing these optimization on your pc so guys let's dive straight into over this video guys in the very first step it is always important to disabling all the power saving features on your pc so for that you have to press windows r together from your keyboard and this run window pop up on your screen now you need to go for the search bar and search for gp edit dot msc and hit enter now go for computer configuration administrative template system now scroll down and find out here this power management option so guys go inside it and open up power throttling settings now here you will find out the settings that is the turn of power throttling but guys before turning off the settings always guys keep in mind if you are on laptop so guys skip the settings but if you are on desktop pc so guys you have to follow the settings on your pc but guys on laptop this will increase your temperature because of poor air flowing so guys you have double tap on the settings now you have to enable the settings on your pc for turning off the power throttling on your pc again guys make sure to follow the settings only on your desktop or just leave it on your laptop now hit apply click ok and close out of this local group policy editor window now in the next step you need these optimized windows registry settings because going through every single setting will take a lot of time so here i made ready-made fortnite registry settings that you can simply apply on your pc with just one click so guys here you will find it every single optimization if you do this separately one by one on your pc so it will take around 10 to 20 minutes but guys by doing this you can just apply it in just a few seconds you will also find out here the reverse registry changes like if you want to revert settings back to the normal so guys you can also do it from here so guys you can find out the link in the description simply go on my website and download this file on your pc once you download now open up the folder and go for optimize windows registry inside you will find out cp purity disable cpu core parking disable fast startup max pre-render frames network throttling and lot of other settings so guys simply double tap on the first registry hit yes hit yes again click ok now go for the next disable cpu one hit yes hit yes again click ok and guys like that installed all this registry on your pc every registry have different performance impact so guys make sure to install all the registry files on your pc by the way if you want to revert the settings back to the normal or the last previous settings so you have to go for the revert changes simply guys install this registry file on your pc for applying the normal stock settings of your windows now you have to go back go for this txt file that is the commands so go inside it and here you will find out all the path for this command like if you want to apply these settings using the registry from your registry editor so guys you can also do it like simply copy the path from here put it in your registry editor and find the window but guys again that will take a lot of time so therefore it is important and recommended to use this registry file that i will provide you now once you are done now you have to close out of it now in the next step you need the software that is the one with affinity and this software will help us to running over fortnite onto the high potential of our system again link in the description simply go there and download the software on your pc now double tap here and here you will find out this kind of the interface now you have to go for this option that is the select program and click onto the three doors now you have to go for the directory where you install your fortnite or any other game like for example i want to optimize my fortnite so you have to go for this pc local dixie now go for program files now find out here epic games fortnite fortnite game folder binary win64 and here you will find out this launcher file so select here click on the open button and add here your fortnite launcher file inside the software now you have to go for this option that the processor section from here select the hot processor core of your processor therefore you can give the maximum performance of your cpu while you're playing fortnite so guys once you are done now next here you'll find out this option that is the shortcut name so guys you have to name it like a run with affinity fortnite and after that guys simply click onto this button that is the uh, create shortcut so guys click on the create shortcut button shortcut created successfully now hit ok and close out of the software now next time whenever you want to launch the fortnite so guys use here this launcher on your pc to running the fortnite on at maximum potential of the cpu of your processor 
Now in the final and the last step, we are going to optimize our Epic Games Launcher settings. So for that, go for your window search, search for Epic Games and open up Epic Games Launcher. Now you have to go onto the right side of your profile icon. Simply click here and go straight into the settings. Now you have to scroll down and find out here this next top notification. Make sure to uncheck these boxes from here. Now you have to scroll down, go for your Fortnite, check mark onto the additional command line argument and use here the same command that is the minus land play, minus no splash, minus no texture streaming and minus use all available code. You will find out this command in the comment below. You will find out this command in the description, simply copy and paste it here. Now after that, now simply one time restart your PC there for all the changes properly take effect. Then launch your Fortnite and enjoy the best performance out of your PC. I hope so you love it. Please make sure to let me know your opinion about this video in the comment below. And I will see you in the next video.